The deadlift. The deadlift is hard but rewarding. It is one of the most common lifts in Mike's program. To do a deadlift, you need a bar on the floor. Stand with your feet a bit narrower than your shoulders. Bend at your waist and grab the bar with your palms facing down. Bend your knees and lift your chest. Keep your back straight and don't arch it. Lift the bar by straightening your legs and hips at the same time. The bar should go up along your shins and thighs. Lower the bar by reversing the steps. Don't bend your hips or knees too early or too late when you lift or lower the bar. Don't wear shoes with cushion or gel because they can make you unstable. Don't make your stance or grip too wide because they can make you uncomfortable and ineffective. The rest of the exercises you'll be doing. There are more exercises in the program, but Mike wants to focus on these three first. You can watch videos of how to do them on bodybuilding.com in the exercises section. Is a spotter necessary? You don't need a spotter, but it can help you a lot. A spotter can motivate you and help you with the weights if they are too heavy for you. If you spot for someone else, remember to let them do most of the work by themselves. Only help them if they need it or if they are stuck at a rep. Chapter 20. Your Thinner Leaner Stronger Workout Plan This chapter will help you create a training plan that works for you. Remember the basics. Don't forget what you learned before about diet and exercise. They are both important for getting the body you want. Warm up first. Before you start working out, make sure your muscles are ready. Warm-up should not make you tired, but just get blood flowing to your muscles and joints. Then, you can do your exercises with some rest between them. You don't need to warm up again for each exercise unless you are using different muscles. Your first workout routine. Your program should match your goals at the end. The best way to get results is to work out five days a week. If you can't, you can change the plan to fit your schedule. Follow the order of the exercises and do them for two months. Then, you can download Mike's free bonus report at the end for more help with diet, training, and supplements. Your first weeks. If you are new to this, it might feel hard and strange at first, but you will get used to it and improve over time. If you feel sharp pain in some areas, stop working out that part for a few weeks and let it heal. If it doesn't get better, see your doctor. Change it up. It is true that changing your routine too often can slow down your progress, but sometimes, it is good to try something new. Just make sure you choose the right exercises. Mike suggests to always keep the deadlift in your routine because it helps your back get stronger and bigger. For women, it's not only about being thin but also having shape and definition. To make your own abs routine, Mike says that you should start with exercises that use weights and then do exercises that don't use weights. After two months, take a break, try other exercises, and listen to your body for about a year. Chapter 21 the No BS Guide to Supplements There are many ads for diet and workout supplements out there. How can you tell what works and what doesn't? Mike will show you some products in this chapter. Protein Supplements Whey is a common protein supplement. It comes from cheese making and it's cheap and easy to make. When you buy whey, look at how much protein it has and how much it costs. Also check what's in it, how big a serving is, and how much protein per serving. BCAAS Branched-chain amino acids help your muscles grow and heal. They make up 35% of your muscle mass and are important for your supplement plan. But most BCAA products only have 15% of them. So only buy them if you work out a lot or on an empty stomach. Pre-workout drink. This is a very hyped-up supplement. But if you take too much, you could end up in hospital or worse. Don't fall for the long list of good ingredients on the label or other science stuff they use to sell it. You might be better off with some caffeine pills, coffee or something like that. Creatine Creatine is found naturally in your body and in lean red meat. It has been studied a lot for its effects on muscles and health. Creatine monohydrate is better than other forms sold in fancy bottles like water-soluble ones. But if monohydrate upsets your stomach, try water-soluble ones. HGH Boosters Human growth hormone boosters have amino acids that are often not given right so they don't work well. Mike says they are a waste of money. Glutamine. This works well if you train for a long time because it helps with stress and tiredness. It also helps make proteins and stop muscle loss. Nitric Oxide Supplements. This supplement says it makes more nitric oxide in your body which helps more oxygen and minerals go into your muscles. It may sound fake at first but Mike says some help them work out better. Multivitamins. If you think you don't get enough vitamins and minerals from your food then this can help. Many athletes use this to fill what they miss and lower their risk of problems. CLA This stands for conjugated linoleic acid. It helps with fat loss because it's a fatty acid found naturally in meat and dairy products. 
It also stops muscle loss because it lowers how much muscle proteins break down. Fat Burners This is a new miracle drug that makes companies lots of money. But Mike says there is no pill that can make you lose fat fast. Green Tea Extract Research shows that green tea extract has catechin which helps you lose fat faster when you exercise and lose belly fat too. Fish Oil Fish oil has essential fatty acids that your body needs but can't make by itself. It helps make muscle proteins better reduce muscle pain and swelling. It also helps with many diseases. For Mike, these are the following top supplements according to his supplement priority. If ever you're short on money for various supplements in the market, protein powder, multivitamin, fish oil, creatine, glutamine, pre-workout drink, fat burner, CLA, and GTE, and a no booster. Mike wants you to see his bonus report for his best product tips. Chapter 22 the Thinner, Leaner, Stronger Supplement Routine This chapter will focus on how to properly use the supplements mentioned in the previous chapter. Protein Supplements Mike prefers getting protein from natural resources but likes to take protein supplements before and after workouts. Research suggests taking whey protein 30 minutes before for maximum benefits. Pre-workout drink Take this drink 30 minutes before workout on an empty stomach. Creatine Clinical studies show that it is best to take 20 grams of creatine daily for 5 minutes 7 days and a maintenance dose of 3 minutes 5 grams in the succeeding days. Experts also say it is important to cycle your creatine intake by doing skips every week or so after regular intake. Glutamine To get the best of this supplement, take it daily without stops. It is recommended that you take 5 minutes 30 grams per day. Nitric Oxide Supplements, Multivitamins, and Fat Burners Simply follow what's on the label before taking it. CLA It is best when dosages of 3-7 grams are distributed to 3 servings per day. Green Tea Extract Studies suggest taking at least 600 mg of this supplement a day. Common GTE contain 300 mg. Fish Oil This supplement is best when taken 3.5-6.5 grams a day as per studies on its effectiveness. In taking supplements or doing training, consistency is the key to success. Follow your plan and stick to it no matter what. Also, spend your money efficiently and combine this supplement plan with other tips to get the best out of your thinner, leaner, stronger program. Chapter 23 Now is the time to work towards your dream body. If you stick to the thinner, leaner, stronger program and stay motivated, you'll see results in a few months. Mike promises that this is the start of a great new lifestyle and body for you. Mike wrote this book to help you and hopes it did. When you finish your fitness journey, let Mike know and share your story. Also, if you want, check out his other book, Muscle Myth.